Namanda, 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 Namanda. Welcome. Thanks for joining me today. Today I wanted to talk a little bit about Obutsudan. Uh, I actually want to start uh, a series of talking about the Obutsudan. Um, the Obutsudan is kind of peculiar to Japan, but uh, um, it's uh, shrines and um, altars have been with us throughout history. Archaeologists have found shrines as long as uh, there's been humans around. So uh, this is nothing new. Uh, it, uh, shrines are something that we, uh, it, I think it's in our DNA. We want to have a sacred place, somewhere we can go and find peace and solace. Uh, people say that uh, shrines and altars are external representations of our internal mysteries. Uh, along with rituals, they allow us to bring out the things that are in our hearts and make, put them into action. Um, the uh, Butsudan actually started out uh, in India, um, from what I understand, where people would uh, erect a, uh, a platform of mud and then place some object of reverence on it. Uh, in Japan, you've heard of Kamidana, which means God Shelf. Uh, so there are many, many God Shelves in many, many homes of different religions, and the Obutsudan is a probably would be called Buddha Shelf. Uh, I will give more about our Obutsudan later. Um, uh, the one that's particular to our Jodo Shinshu tradition explain a little bit about the implements of the Obutsudan and service uh, at the Obutsudan. So again, thank you for joining me today. Namu Amida Butsudan.